Here are your headlines from CBS Chicago. I'm Suzanne Lemonio. Meteorologist Ed Kern is here now with a check of the forecast. And for many, a beautiful Mother's Day today, though we do have some active weather around parts of the country. Areas in blue you're looking at, places where we could see thunderstorms pop as we go through the day for today. As for the chance for severe, there is a chance two areas for severe storms. The green areas here, a marginal chance for severe storms as we go through the day. Northeast cannot shake the rain. We continue the rain through the day here up in New England and some showers in New York as well. As we go into tonight and into Monday morning, you still hold on to some rain before it finally pulls out of here. So we're uh, looking at that as we go through the day today. Temperatures 71 degrees in Los Angeles, 82 degrees in Fargo, uh, 82 degrees up in Minneapolis, 72 in Chicago, but you work your way away from the lake and you're looking at temperatures up near 80 degrees, 66 degrees in New York. Here's the Chicago forecast for Mother's Day, 79 degrees, sunny, cooler by Lake Michigan, though, 82 degrees on Monday, sunny and 86 degrees by Tuesday. Suzanne? Thanks, Ed. A special brunch celebrates moms with babies in neonatal intensive care and the kind folks who help them. This was the Thanks a Whole Brunch event at the Hard Rock Hotel. It's hosted by the Jackson Chance Foundation, named for a little boy who was born 10 weeks early and passed away from medical complications. Jackson's mom, who created the foundation, says it's her way to thank the staff at Lurie's Children's Hospital for their profound work. I had two babies who were in the NICU and the nurses, the doctors, the therapists are so wonderful and take care of the babies when we can't be there. So we're just so grateful for all of them. The Jackson Chance Foundation also pays the parking for families of babies in the NICU. Now, when it comes to Mother's Day, loved ones are shelling out more than ever before. The National Retail Federation estimates that U.S. shoppers are spending more than $23 billion celebrating moms this year. That's a record. More people purchase fresh flowers and plants on Mother's Day than for any other holiday except Christmas and Hanukkah. Mayor Rahm Emanuel is on the move to spruce up another piece of the lakefront. All right. Awesome. All right. The mayor helped break ground in the 2400 block of North Lakeshore Drive. It's part of the next segment of the lakefront trail separation. Some runners even stopped to look at the sketches for the new plan. The project will create a trail for cyclists and a separate trail for walkers and runners. We say congratulations to the new graduates from City Colleges of Chicago. <laughs> Smiles all around during the ceremony at the UIC Pavilion. 1,800 graduates earned their associate degrees. There are seven City Colleges of Chicago. Oprah Winfrey also offered her advice to graduates. Winning is great. It's fantastic. I love it. I love being number one. I love winning. But it's the times when things go wrong, when you fall or fail, that you're actually going to learn the most about yourself. Winfrey delivered the keynote address to Agnes Scott College in Decatur, Georgia, and she ended the speech acknowledging that nobody makes it alone and that the graduates should find a way to nurture themselves. Now for the very latest headlines anytime, day or night, head to CBSChicago.com. I'm Suzanne Lemonio. Have a wonderful day.